Good day, Martin Yetrun of Ministry, speaking on the book The Scroll. And um, it's a privilege to open things in the Word of God to the church. Um, I love it to teach. Um, I want you to focus on um, page 30, or um, let me know, it's actually page, um, page 27, you will see Kainos and Kairos, the word Kainos and Kairos, and I want to explain that to you, because it is about the kingdom age. The word age means a time, a space or a time frame. So if we say this age or that age, it means time of space. It's a time, a time word. It's very important to know that the kingdom of God and the age for the kingdom of God means the time for the kingdom of God. So Jesus said 2000 years ago to his disciples, go and preach. The kingdom of God is at hand. It's close. It's near. He said it before the cross. And they had to go and preach. Because the kingdom of God came when Jesus Christ was um, on the cross. He died for us. And he rose from the grave. And he gave um, his spirit upon mankind. And this age started. The kingdom age. That age we call Kainos. The Kainos time. It is a time where God's kingdom rule on earth in our hearts. Because the kingdom of God is in us. It is righteousness, joy and peace of the Holy Spirit. Now, you get the word Kainos. It means season or time or space or other word is world. And then you get Kairos. Kairos is a specific moment in the Kainos time of space. So God is working and is giving specific Kairos moments in people's life in Kainos. But let me explain it to you. When Jesus Christ died, he was the seed that fell to the ground. And that seed became a big tree that needed to grow. So Kainos started when Jesus Christ died for mankind. And we are living now in the kingdom age, in the kingdom season. But heaven and earth met or was reconciled with each other. God is from heaven and man reconciled, they met. Or kiss. Um, reconciliation is to kiss, to be, to, to be one. So, Kainos started there and we are living in the Kainos season on earth. For 2000 years we are already in the Kainos season. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Then, every man that lives on this timeline lives in the Kainos season or in the seed and could fully inherit all blessings any time any blessings that was in the seed because the promise was made in the seed we sometimes think that prophecy and words is for specific time in the Kainos but it's not true it is in Kainos season and everyone can have a Kairos moment in the Kainos season to inherit that. God is not saying I'm going to do this in the um, let's say 100 after Christ and then this 500 after Christ and then a Suzar um, um, you know street outpouring and this outpouring and that outpouring I will do it in the Kairos moment that's my plan you cannot do anything um, by just waiting for my time I believe in Kainos every man that walks any time on this earth can have the 
kairos moments of God, that specific moments where you hunger and thirst and focus and believe in God and seek Him, God will pour out His Spirit upon you and you can be filled more and more and more as you get Kairos moments in the Kaino season of God. And not waiting, well the Lord is going to do 2020 an outpouring and we must all wait for that. Because that will be a Kairos moment in God's sight. Now Kairos moment is from our side as we take everything that's already in the seed, the life and glory and everything is in the seed, Jesus Christ. And he started it. And in the fullness of time, God sent His Son. That means when time was full, time can now be more. There's no more time when time is full. The, the waiting of time is over for mankind. We, time has come to the full where man can receive everything from God. I want to read this, Galatians 4 verse 10, where Paul said 2000 years ago ye you observe days ye observe days and months and times and years and then it says verse 11 i am afraid of you lest i have bestowed upon you labor in vain i've teach you man is my labor in you for nothing I've teach you, why do you observe times and seasons and stuff like that? Don't you know we are living in the kingdom age? Where everything is in Christ? And whosoever will call upon the name of the Lord will be saved and will, have, uh, will be filled with His Spirit. The former and the latter is for all men as you seek it. And ask for it and hunger for it and believe in it and meditate on it and have faith in it. God will pour out His Spirit. We always look backwards and then we say, oh, it's now 2018. Okay, Azusa Street, it was 1901. Okay, so the Lord had a plan for those people. No, that plan is for all people, all time in Kainos. And as individuals come together and say, let's look, for the, let's look for the Spirit of the Lord, the outpouring, we hunger and we start to pray and pray and pray. Then there's an outpouring and there's something happening and people's lives change and, and cities change and like the Reformation video. And we always look afterwards and thought, okay, that was a Kairos moment, God um, said, it was now time for that. I don't believe that. I believe any moment is your moment. Lest, Paul said, lest did I um, work in vain with you? Why do you focus naturally on times and seasons and months and days? Don't you know, in the Spirit, in God, there is no more time. Revelation, there will no there is no more time. So I hope you understand that. May God bless you. In Jesus mighty name. Amen.